store right now. During the pandemic, a lot of businesses had trouble keeping staffed up. And you, you could understand that. It's 2023 now. If the store is is consistently when you pull up to their drive-thru, not having any of the food available, I'm afraid they're they're not gonna make it. Here we got Jack in the Box, breakfast served all day on the sign. And there is a car here, so probably somebody's gonna say something when I pull up to, to order. I just don't know if it's gonna be sure we can do that, because that tends not to be what I hear. Jack in the box, I do apologize that this time we're unable to do any sandwiches or any breakfasts. We're only able to do fryer food. May I take your order? No, thank you. That is the typical message at this Jack in the box. They're basically not able to make most of their menu. <laughs> and sometimes I, d I will stop at that point and I'll say, you know, okay, give me a vanilla shake. And the last couple times I've tried that, they haven't even had that. Haven't able to be able to do that. So uh, I don't know how much longer this store is going to be open because even if they fix it now, it's been so long, and so many people have come to this store and not been served that I think the people have given up trying. You know, I don't see a line. It used to be there was a big line there in the mornings, and they, they've just not been able to function. I mean, this is morning. It is five minutes till seven. I mean, if people out on a Friday and, and they were, you know, I'm just, uh, I'm afraid we're going to lose that store just because even if they get people back in there working, is anybody going to try to see if they're open? 